Okay, quick unboxing of Trick or Treat Studios Universal Monsters Trick or Treat Buckets. I just saw these online. I know the Halloween 3 ones uh, sold out. I have a pre-order of those, so I don't know if they'll go through or not. But let's see how these guys look. I got these from Monsters in Motion, third party, after I had some issues with Trick or Treat Studios. Oh, there's a Frank. Wow, dude. Frank is a lot brighter than I thought, but I really like that sculpt. That looks a lot like Boris Karloff. That's cool. Got the handle. Definitely worth the 20 bucks or whatever it was. Um, also got the creature. I like the paint jobs on these a lot. It's something different. Pretty thick. They're a little bit thicker. Eh, maybe they're about the same thickness as the old school pumpkins. And roughly the same size as the old school pumpkins. From the 80s. So, yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. They lost the license recently to Universal Monsters. So I don't think you can get these anymore. Same with the uh, Halloween 3 buckets. I'll be lucky if I get those. But uh, if you order those, that's what you'll be getting.